There's one. Oh yeah, good one. All right, guys, day one of the BFL Regional out here on the St. Johns River. We're about 119 today. Everybody's stacking up over here by the bridge, but uh, we're just gonna wait it out a little bit. Got a little bit of time before we end up launching. Got a 4.30 check-in today. Uh, it's been fishing kind of tough, but I think I can get a good bag. We'll go out there and just try to catch them. Hopefully we bring back five big ones today and uh, go back out there tomorrow and do it again. It's a three-day tournament. Top 12 will qualify for day three. So we gotta catch them good over the next few days. Let's go out there and catch a bag. I don't even know how I hooked him. You sucker. No! God! I bet my hook out on him. like a four pounder. <sighs> Sorry. That was a different fish. <laughs> it's like a one pounder. Skinny. No! God! Huh? Around the tree? God. <laughs>
big one. Christian Greco, five bass fishing as the motor is alligator division. Nine pounds and seven ounces, nine seventy-five. Nine pounds and seven ounces, nine seven. Thank you, man. Thank you. All right. Well, as you guys saw, we did not catch him today. It was tough out there, had a couple of bad breaks, had that one straighten out the frog hook, had the one come off on the frog, probably should have had around 14 pounds, uh, but it could have been a lot worse. I pulled up on that shell bar pretty last minute and put that three pounder in the boat. Uh, but we're gonna have to catch them pretty good tomorrow to get back into this thing. The weights are pretty hot. Two bags over 30 pounds already weighed in. Um, so I'm probably gonna need 20 plus to get back into this thing tomorrow. But obviously they're out there, they're catching them pretty good. I'm gonna switch up the game plan for tomorrow. Made a long run down the river today. I'm not gonna do that again tomorrow. The fish just didn't seem to be down there. Uh, so I'm gonna kind of think about what my best options are for just catching a big bag out here and, and put together a game plan. Stay tuned for day two. No, it's pretty big. Basically anywhere on the outside of these pads. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, that one felt pretty good. He's pulled off. Look at that. <laughs> Took half my worm. bit the tail off. I don't know if they're bass or what. They're kind of hitting it funny. Mud fish. Ah. Yeah. I got him. Mudfish. Mudfish. Yeah, the other one might have been. There's one. Oh yeah, good one. Lay it on. 
Yeah, if we had one. <laughs> I got him. That's a big fish, yeah. It's like a five pounder. Turn your live wheel on. Yep. Eat it too. Yeah, I just caught it. That's better. I thought it'd be a stick. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Five thirty six. Uh, like a couple miles north of the bridge. Where are you at? Oh, hang on, I got one. Three pounder. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Man. Two fish. Greco. Greco. Tristan Greco, yesterday hit 9 7, fish another boater. Tell the gate of the beast, he brings us two bass today. Good weight on the two fish. 8 pounds, 7 ounces, total weight 17 14, still in paycheck ring. Thank you. Alright, guys, that's going to do it for the St. John's. BFL Regional ended up finishing in 46th place not the finish I was looking for um, But not bad out of a field of about 180 boats Definitely was planning and fishing to make that final day, uh, but it just didn't come together today Got two of the right bites today. I was looking basically for five big ones to get back into this thing came across two of them uh, But overall it was pretty tough didn't get many bites at all today had a few mud fish bites few gar bites, but I think those those were the only two real good bass bites I got um, throughout the day. And I was just running new water, just fishing new stuff, just trying to find that one spot that maybe I could catch 20, 25 pounds off of. Um, once I hooked that five pounder on the shell bar, I thought maybe it could happen, but it just ended up being the only fish out there that I could get. But thanks for watching this video, guys. I appreciate it as always. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. We are packed up and heading to Pickwick Lake next for the Toyota Championship. $200,000 on the line there. Uh, so the practice video for that one is going to be the next video followed by the tournament video there at Pickwick for the Major League Fishing Toyota Series Championship. So we will see you from Pickwick.